Bienvenidos al último día de dictado. El día de hoy no vamos a tener una lección antes de dictado, solamente voy a leer el dictado para ti. Y esto es para que ustedes tengan oportunidad, chicos, de tener tiempo extra en casa para terminar cualquier trabajo que no hayan terminado durante la semana. Agarra tu papel, agarra tu lápiz y prepárate para escribir el dictado. Si tienes que poner pausa para agarrar tus materiales, hazlo ya. Susan B. Anthony felt that women should have the same rights as men. She was making about one-fourth what a man will make for the same job. She became involved in trying to get the government to let women vote and to enact laws that women should have equal rights with men. At first, she would speak at conventions. Then, she helped run a civil rights newspaper called The Revolution. On 1878, Susan wrote a draft to what we currently know as the 19th Amendment. Now you repeat after me. Susan B. Anthony felt the woman should have the same rights as men. She was making about one-fourth what a man will make for the same job. She became involved in trying to get the government to let women vote and to enact laws that women should have, the say, should have equal rights with men. At first, she will speak at conventions. Then, she helped run a civil rights newspaper called The Revolution. On 1878, Susan wrote a draft to what we currently know as the 19th Amendment. Now we're going to read together in three, two, one, go. Susan B. Anthony felt the woman should have the same rights as men. She was making about one-fourth what a man will make for the same job. She became involved in trying to get the government to let women vote and to enact laws that women should have equal rights with men. At first, she will speak at conventions. Then, she helped run a civil rights newspaper called The Revolution. On 1878, Susan wrote a draft to what we currently know as the 19th Amendment. Okay, friends, check your work, send a picture to your teacher. When you are done, I'm going to start dictating. As always, I will repeat three times the sentence. If you need to hear it again, just replay the video. Susan B. Anthony felt the woman should have the same rights as men. Susan B. Anthony felt the woman should have the same rights as men. Susan B. Anthony felt the woman should have the same rights as men. Susan B. Anthony felt the woman should have the same rights as men. Period. She was making about one-fourth what a man will make for the same job.
She was making about one-fourth what a man will make for the same job. She was making about one-fourth what a man will make for the same job. Period. She became involved in trying to get the government to let women vote. She became involved in trying to get the government to let women vote. She became involved in trying to get the government to let women vote. No period, no comma. And to enact laws that women should have equal rights with men. And to enact laws that women should have equal rights with men. And to enact laws that women should have equal rights with men. Period. At first, she will speak at conventions. At first, she will speak at conventions. At first, she will speak at conventions, period. Then, she helped run a civil rights, news, a civil rights newspaper called The Revolution. Then, she helped run a civil rights newspaper called The Revolution. Period. On 1878, Susan wrote a draft to what we currently know as the 19th Amendment. Yeah. <laughs> On 1878, Susan wrote a draft to what we currently know as the 19th Amendment. On 
1878, Susan wrote a draft to what we currently know as the 19th Amendment. Period. If you need to listen to any of the sentences, please go back and replay the video. If not, just move on. Remember, you have to check word by word, and then you have, a, you have to send a picture to your teacher. When I say go, you may pause this video so you can keep this screen and check your work. Go.